Taiwan and Hollywood's hottest stars were in attendance at this year's Asia Summit in Singapore. Hi, TVBS. This is JJ Lin. Really good to be here. We also want to understand how the trend is going. Then the technology issue, the energy issue, and how the future will be. 就整个发展会怎么样？因为其实我们自己公司也是做内容的嘛，然后你也要关注一些世界上正在即将要发生然后的走向，所以呃也是受到一些朋友的邀请，然后也很多朋友在这边就一起来听一个这个高峰会议这样子。As it seems that Asians in the entertainment industry are now taking over the world, Henry Golding shared his hopes for the future when it comes to Asian-created content. There is so much value in promoting.、Um, Ethnicity in, in terms of oh, this is the next big Asian film that everybody has to watch, and, and that's what we want to sort of rally for. And I think it's going to be a long, long time from fighting, you know, swimming upstream where it becomes, you know, just the movie that everybody should watch. Henry also revealed that he almost turned down the role that shot him into Hollywood superstardom. Resist the call、uh, to audition for your first ever movie. Uh, it took three, three、uh, sort of no's for John M. Chu to get a hold of me, and、um, he was kind of like perplexed that like why would somebody not audition for this? And I was like, well, I'm not an actor. I was a presenter. I was a, I was a journalist. I was、uh, a storyteller in that sort of sense of、uh, word.、Um, and so for me, it was it was a step into the. And not just movies and music. Asian-style matchmaking is also stirring up a buzz on TV. Matchmaker Sima shared with guests at the Asia Summit her secrets when it comes to a match made in heaven. You have to have patience, little adjustment, little、uh, compromise, and appreciate each other. Partners who appreciate each other, then the life will go smoothly. From reality shows, movies to music, more content from Asian creatives continue to be rolled out. What are some of your favorites? TVBS English News.